Good morning, Good morning Ray for Olympians. Olympians. Welcome back to Torch TV. Today is Friday, May 11th, 2018. Today we will be on an even class period schedule. Attention 8th graders, the end of the year dance is quickly approaching. Mark your calendars for Friday, June 1st. Come dress to impress and ready to party. Tickets will go on sale Monday. The price is $15 and the food at the dance is all you can eat. Please make sure you pick up a permission slip in the office on Wednesday or Thursday to turn in with your money. Be a part of the fun next year in one of the choirs at KHS. Join men's ensemble, women's ensemble, concert choir, advanced women's ensemble, or jazz choir. For more info, contact Mr. Minderup at rminderup at kingsburghigh.com or 559-419-6390. Tryouts will be happening soon. Now let's please welcome Cy. Hey yo, what's poppin'? It's Cubside back here with another segment on Coin Wars. We talked to Chase D as the school president about this fundraiser. He likes the fundraiser and how it works, but he is new to it since he's never participated in it. He thinks Coin Wars will benefit the school because we'll be raising money for the school and that it will be more outwards to the community. He think he likes this fundraiser because it is the only fundraiser that uses coins and also can be very competitive. Ms. Crisman commented on how it benefits the school and the community by saying it, it's benefiting positive connections. Also for you guys that don't know how Coin Wars works, Mrs. Crisman was happy to say that silver money is good for your class and pennies get, are negative so you can sabotage other classes. She said Coin Wars can be the best fundraiser if we all participate. There will be a pizza party for the winning class. That's all for this week guys, don't forget to do the one, the only, the original, a dab on them haters. See ya. Thank you, Cy. All track uniforms need to be returned to Miss Beck today. On Monday, May 14th, baseball and softball will compete in the league playoffs. Softball will be at KHS and baseball will be in Fowler at Sutter Middle School. All games begin at 2 p.m. Come out and support their efforts to be league champions. Entry is $2 for adults and $1 for students. Now let's please welcome Robert. Hey, what's up guys? It's Robert the Robert, stealing the newest trends, back with another segment. Today we have some new trends and a new exciting reporter to talk about it. So what's it going to be this week? We asked quite a few people, so i got to be fast. We asked Mr. Rigetti what trend he has seen, and he says he's seen a lot of man buns lately. Then we asked what some of the trends he dislikes are, and he said yoga pants. Anyway, we had another, uh, yet another question for him, and it was, so what are some of the trends that you have worn? He said bleached hair, and the very last question for him was, what was your favorite song? He answered with Black, Back in Black by ACDC. We also interviewed Elijah, Nick, and Daisy to ask what their favorite trends are. Elijah said that his favorite trend is Jordan's, his least favorite is Hype Beast, and his trendiest elective is Woodshop. Elijah's trendiest song right now is SOB Antisocial. Uh, Nick said that Air Force Ones would be his favorite trend. His least favorite trend is skinny jeans. The trendiest elective is Office Aid, and the trendiest song is Always by SOB. Daisy said that pink was her favorite trend, and Daisy said that man buns were her least favorite. Art was her trendiest elective. Always by SOB is her trendiest song. Well, gotta run, literally. Gonna get arrested. Bye. Thank you, Robert. Please help keep our campus, campus clean by picking up after yourselves. And the shout-out of kindness is... Mabel, for having nice hair. Remember, a hero is someone who voluntarily walks into the unknown. Have a wonderful day. Now please stand and be respectful as your teacher leads you in the flag salute. I'm Luke. And I'm Sophia. And, and you've just been torched. torched.